My bladder is not the strongest at the best of times and this has not made it better. It's not even that bad. Oh, I can't do it. I'm so hungry. I could so have a barbecue right now. <laughs> you look like you like it less than yesterday. It's just like carrot central. I feel like I need to stop getting my hopes up. Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I have decided to do a juice cleanse. Um, for no particular reason, I just thought it's something fun to do while we're in lockdown and uh, we'll just kind of see what happens. So we've just got back from Tesco with all the stuff. It cost us £43 and we've got four days worth of stuff for two of us. So we didn't think that was too bad of a price. Um, and I'll just quickly go through everything that we kind of bought. So we have 82 apples, a root of ginger, a lemon and a banana. We have 10 pineapples, 11 limes, seven, actually eight avocados. We've got nine, but actually 10 sticks of celery, 400 grams of yogurt, but we actually have 500, five cucumbers, a bag of spinach, eight carrots, but we just bought one bag and two bags of ice. We also have a little jar of cinnamon. There is one extra juice you're supposed to have, have every day, but it had broccoli, celery, beetroot, carrots, loads of stuff we didn't like in it, so we just decided we won't have that one. Um, as I said, we don't really eat that much in general, so we should be fine with one less every day. So this is what the fridge currently looks like. So it is day one of our juice cleanse. We're just about to do our breakfast juice. It's currently 9.30 in the morning and I'm gonna make enough for four people since we're supposed to have it one at eight, but I didn't wanna wake up that early since I have nowhere to go. And then one at 11, instead we're gonna do 9.30 and 12. So I'm just gonna kind of show you guys what we have and then I'll get into it. So we have eight apples, a whole cucumber, two limes, an avocado, and a full pineapple. So we've now chopped up all our veg and we're just gonna basically put it all through the juicer, um, except the avocado, which has to go in the blender afterwards. just here. I'm going to taste it for you guys in a minute. Um, and I've put the other two in the fridge so we can have them at around 12 o'clock basically for lunch. Okay, here goes. Let's have the first taste of juice. Honestly, I've had that one before and it's so nice. It just tastes like lime to me. Maybe I put too much lime in. I don't know, but I really like that one. Um, I know there are some coming up that I really don't like because some of them have carrots in and I hate carrots so much. We did knock the one out, as I said yesterday, we knocked the one out that like has so many things in that both me and my mum don't like, but we had to keep the carrots one in. You also have to have apple with cinnamon every night and I kind of hate cinnamon, but we'll see kind of what happens. Could be funny, who knows? So I've just been and grabbed my second juice of the day as i said earlier is the same one as i had this morning up to now i feel pretty good i must say um i'm trying to avoid like instagram and stuff like that because i follow a load of vegan food pages and obviously they're just like posting loads of stuff that looks really good so i'm trying to stay away from that but other than that i still feel pretty good about it all so that is a good sign obviously we have a long way to go yet <laughs> So it is now time for our third juice of the day. It's just around three o'clock and I'll just quickly show you what ingredients we'll put in in our next juice. So again, this is for two people, not four this time. We have four apples, half of a lime, a quarter of a cucumber, a stick of celery, two thirds of a pineapple and half an avocado uh, along with a handful of baby spinach or actually any kind of spinach is fine. So I've just come upstairs with my third smoothie of the day. This one is slightly different, so I'll just try to see if I like it or not. I 
Okay, so you can taste the fact that there's celery in here and I am not keen on celery. But other than that, it's pretty nice. Addressing everything else, I haven't been hungry all day, which is a really good sign. The only things I've noticed that have kind of slightly differed from like my usual day is I was kind of tired earlier, but that could just be that I woke up kind of early this morning compared to at the weekend. And also my bladder is not the strongest at the best of times, and this has not made it better. Sorry if that's too much information. Um, but yeah, so that's not been great either. But obviously because I'm at home, it doesn't really matter that much. It's not inconvenienced me and other than that, everything is completely normal so that is now my third drink gone and honestly i actually feel so much better i feel less tired now i've had it um and i'm just gonna get on with more studying and all the other stuff i have to do so we're ready for our fourth juice of the day uh this is not gonna be fun for me honestly it's four carrots four apples half a lemon and a piece of ginger and that's for two people but i hate carrots and ginger so this may not be fun So here we are, juice number four. Um, I basically put loads of ice in it so that it'll be a bit more slushy like. I honestly don't know if that's going to be a good thing or a bad thing for this experience, but I am not looking forward to it, let's just say that. I literally hate carrots so much. Okay, here goes. It's not even that bad. Like, it's definitely drinkable. I thought it would be so much worse. I can't even taste carrot or ginger. I have no idea what I can taste. It kind of tastes like celery. I don't know what's happening. But honestly, this is not that bad. I'm impressed. I could definitely drink this for a couple more days. It's pretty nice. <laughs> I'm so shocked. So I've pretty much finished this carrot, apple, ginger and lemon juice and honestly I stand by what I said, it's not that bad. I definitely wouldn't pick it, it's not my favourite but the fact that I even managed to drink it all is pretty impressive. The aftertaste is not the best but I think because it was quite cold it was alright. I am feeling pretty full now, like I've not gotten really hungry all day, I'm not tired anymore and like I don't have a headache or anything like that. So honestly, day one is pretty good. I have one more juice this evening, which is apple juice, uh, heated up with cinnamon powder. That is gonna be interesting since I don't really like cinnamon, but we'll see what it's like when we get there. Well, we've just heated up our four juiced apples with like a teaspoon or something of cinnamon. You can just put in whatever you like. We don't like cinnamon, so yeah, I'm really not looking forward to this. I think I'm gonna hate it, but let's just. So it's safe to say I am not excited about this. Go ahead, it's nice, honestly, you'll mm. like it. I promise you'll like it. Does it really have a Oh, I can't do it. Every time I just get a close, I'm like, no. Well, otherwise you're gonna become hungry. Yeah. I'd rather be hungry. <laughs> not that bad i do not like cinnamon or hot drinks and it turns out it's actually quite nice so there you go <laughs> so it turns out it's supposed to be a pinch of cinnamon and not like half a teaspoon or a teaspoon so that wasn't good i did like after the first sip that i took i thought that's pretty good and then as it went on it just got worse and then after about three or four sips i was like this is just so bad it tasted like not crunchy but you could taste the like the grains of cinnamon if that's the way to word it i have no idea but basically i poured it away because i like i couldn't drink it i just didn't like it but the initial taste was okay so i think we have that one again tomorrow at the same time and if we do just put like a tiny bit of cinnamon in i think it could actually be okay uh, we'll see make sure you stay tuned until that point to see what happens there Good morning everyone, so it's officially day number two of this juice cleanse. I've just made the first juice of the day, which is the same one we had yesterday morning and we will be having it twice again today. In terms of how I'm feeling, I feel absolutely 100% normal, nothing at all feels different as of yet. I really don't want to speak too soon because apparently day two and three are the worst days, but we'll kind of see how it goes. As I say, right now I feel completely fine, so... And as a bonus, it still tastes nice. So it is, oh, my hair is looking fabulous. 
uh, I did just get out of the shower. Um, it is now like quarter past 12-ish and I'm just about to have my second juice of the day. I do actually feel fine still. I'm a little bit hungry, but obviously that will be expected because it's lunchtime. The thing that's going to be hard about today is that for my other channel, Lauren Rachel, we are filming recreating the Mickey Rice Krispie treats. I mean, obviously we can't eat them. I planned out to do this video before I decided to do the juice cleanse video. So basically I've had to leave it in there because we couldn't go out and get resources to do any other video in time. Um, so we're having to stick with that and we're just going to freeze it. They're not going to go to waste. We're going to freeze them until after the juice cleanse is finished. But it's going to be very hard to be like melting chocolate and marshmallows and stuff like that and not be able to eat any of it. So that's probably going to be the hardest bit of today. But as I say, I actually feel fine right now and I'm just about to drink this juice, which is the same one as I had this morning. This is so like really good. This is definitely my favourite one. So I've just made my third and fourth juices of the day. They are both this one, which is the third one we had yesterday. It's the one that I said has celery in it and I can taste the celery, which I'm not keen on. And I stand by that point. In terms of hunger and everything else, I am pretty much fine. I've not started filming for the Rice Krispie Treat yet, so we'll see how that goes in a little while. But as of right now, I'm absolutely fine. So I have now finished my third juice of the day. Um, and like something's kind of come to my realization that everybody says day two is the worst, or like day two and three are the worst days. Now obviously it is different for everyone and I haven't got that far yet, so I really don't want to speak too soon. Um, but one thing for me is that I'm not really addicted um, to anything like I don't drink any drinks with caffeine in. I don't really eat any refined sugar that often because obviously I can't have like chocolate bars. I occasionally have like a little bag of sweets or something little but I'm not like totally addicted to it. If you had said this to me like five years ago definitely would have been. Uh, and like fat wise I don't really have like burgers or anything like that. I think I eat like relatively healthy in day to day. So it means that I'm not like having the withdrawals from like the refined sugar and the fats and like the carbs. I mean, to be fair, I eat a lot of bread and like stuff, but honestly, that's one thing that's worked really well for me that so far I actually feel really good about everything. I am a little bit more tired than usual. I did say this yesterday as well. I think it hits like three o'clock and I'm like, wow, I'm really tired, but I'm just gonna get up now, go film and just push through it. And honestly, everything should be fine. So I am now back after filming the Rice Krispie Treat video. It went pretty well in terms of not eating anything, in terms of actually making them interesting. So make sure to go check that out. I'll link my other channel up there. Um, but I am now back with my Four, I think juice of the day which is the same as I had uh, this afternoon about three o'clock and it's the same as yesterday it's around five o'clock I start getting hungry and I actually like really want some food and I feel like I did really well in not eating any of the chocolate or anything while we were baking but yeah so I am really hungry at this point I'm gonna just drink this see how I feel I did go outside earlier just to get something and it smelled like barbecue. Somebody must be having a barbecue outside and oh my gosh, that was like, oh, I'm so hungry. I could so have a barbecue right now. So it is now that time of day again. We have the apple juice with the cinnamon and it's like heated up in a pan. I put a lot less cinnamon in today, so hopefully, fingers crossed, it should be nicer. I'm not as nervous about it today because it's not going to be too cinnamony, but let's give it a go. You don't like you like it less than yesterday. <laughs> the apple you don't I mean, like. <laughs> like. I actually don't like apple. <laughs> I think I was expecting too much from it. <laughs> I was like, oh, this is gonna be really good, and then it wasn't. <laughs> no, I'm just disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> now you see why they put so many. It's so bad. <laughs> Like not even overreacting one bit, I do not like it. <sighs> no. Just drink it like medicine. <laughs> That's that much medicine. <laughs> You'd have like one spoon, I could do that. <laughs> I feel like you kind of get used to it a bit. Yeah, I'm definitely getting used to it. I think I had my hopes too high of what it was gonna be like. It's like, okay, I might be able to drink it all. I will update if I manage to drink it all. Um, but I definitely wouldn't say that I like it. And then we're all straight now. 
I hate the bits. The no, bits. No, I didn't bring the bits. I just ran up to the How bits. How do you? They stayed, in the, they stayed in the bottom. Don't swirl them, you know. <laughs> Oh, I had one sip and then it was all right and then I had one like a second after and it was not all right and then like I was confident because I was like oh that one was really good so I'll have another one and then it was like, no it was a bad one again look at the bit though they stay there they don't come up we've managed it is that as far as it's going you yeah. so this is the outcome there's like that much left. The bits are just getting me too much. I can't drink the rest, but it's better than yesterday. Yesterday, I probably had like that much left. So improvement, hopefully tomorrow. I think we have it again tomorrow, don't we? Tomorrow, I might be able to drink the whole thing. It is now morning number three. I am actually feeling quite hungry this morning, but it's quite a lot later. Um, it's quarter to 11. I made the juice at around quarter past nine, but I did not fancy it because guess what? carrot juice um last time i actually didn't mind it but it still just makes me nervous like the smell and the thought of it i'm just like so let's just see how it is it's really not too bad to be honest i can taste the ginger more than i could last time so i must have put a little bit extra in and you can't really taste it that carroty i think it's just because it's so orange it's just like carrot central but yeah, it's, it's not too bad. I can definitely drink it. I didn't make it slushy like today, but I did still put quite a lot of ice in it and then I put it in the fridge. And I definitely think the colder it is, it, the better. Like, if this was room temperature, I would not be able to drink it. So, you know what? It's all right. But later today, we get a new juice, which is like yogurt and banana and they're not exactly my favorite foods but i'm actually so excited because they're a bit more like foodie so it's like a smoothie rather than a juice and that's around three o'clock today so i'm very excited for that one we're following jason vale's juice plan according to him around like halfway through the third day you can get past the not wanting to do it thing and like wanting to eat other food so i'm hoping soon i will get past it i've not been too bad to be fair especially because like both me and my mom are doing the juicing so there's nobody in the house that's like eating normal food obviously there's no temptation like mcdonald's because that's closed like there's hardly anything to tempt us we don't really have much that much other food in the house especially not like unhealthy stuff so actually i'm feeling pretty good but we'll see how what happens as the day goes on it is currently half past 12 and i'm just drinking my second juice of the day which is the green one the one that we had for breakfast on the other two days um honestly i just can't wait for the one with yogurt in it now as i said before i kind of feel fine i'm just a bit fed up of it but other than that everything's all right i'm not really that excited but i'm just making our next juice of the day which is the one with the yogurt and the banana and we're also putting in half a pineapple and two apples and that is enough for two people so i've just come back upstairs with my smoothie type drink i kind of wish i had just chopped the bananas up and put them in yogurt but i think it would have been like not very sweet because we bought unsweetened yogurt so i don't know how this is going to be but it is like more like milkshake consistency than like yogurt i feel like i need to stop getting my hopes up i mean like oh it's going to be so good it's not amazing it's okay it's just if I could put like a tablespoon of sugar in, it'd probably be a lot nicer. I feel like I've been looking forward to it too much and I do not like the taste. <laughs> oh, that is so depressing. I've been literally waiting for three days for this. This was like the thing I was most excited for and it's not even that good. It doesn't even get better. I am not keen at all. It's weird though, because I feel like I like all the things that are in there. It's kind of okay, but the aftertaste is just not nice. Major regrets. Oh well, I'll be enjoying this, not really for the next hour or so. 
I've just made my fourth juice of the day, which is the same one we had both the other days, um, which has the celery in. It's like, okay, we have two of these today and we're not having a hot and spicy tonight because one, I hate it, and two, we had the yogurt one, which I also hated, um, but it means that we don't need an extra one because we've been knocking one off every day. So this one and one more to go. Still pretty refreshing, I must admit. We are officially onto the last juice now, um, which is the same one I had earlier, so I didn't have to make it just now. Honestly, I'm feeling okay. So I had kind of an issue this afternoon where I have an exam on Tuesday and my brain just was not functioning properly. I was fine in all other aspects, but I was trying to write sentences and it was just like taking all my concentration to like think about what the sentence actually said rather than just like copying it down if that makes any sense like i just kept writing the wrong thing and it wasn't good so i'm glad this is over at this point um but hopefully when i finish all my exams in a few weeks we might try and do a seven day one if we can um it might be in like july it depends how long we're in lockdown for but if we're in lockdown for quite a long time i definitely think we'll try and do a week long or at least like a five day one when i have nothing to concentrate on um but for now seven days would just not be practical because i I really need to concentrate on my exams on Tuesday and then I have three more after that so there's that um, but here's to the last drink it's actually still really good tastes kind of celery-ish but I think I'm kind of getting used to it yeah it's been a good three days I've enjoyed doing it we are gonna try and continue to eat like pretty well so we're gonna still have at least one juice a day and then we're gonna try and have like a lot more vegetables so in general I would say I eat quite healthily but sometimes especially during lockdown because we have to go to the shop less often we haven't been getting as many fruits and vegetables but we're gonna try and keep it off as much as we can if you guys did enjoy this video please give it a massive thumbs up make sure to go and check out my other channel if you are interested in disney which is lauren rachel and i will see you next sunday with a brand new video bye